And we're back. I uh, had some formatting with uh, my screen, and so I missed a couple of things. All I did was I moved my agent over here, took the little army that was there, which was just one spear levy, and uh, I think it was my dynamo, dynamo, and moved them over here. Currently at war with uh, the N Nabeuka. Anyways, Nabeuka, um, and I. I gotta kill him. Police station. I'm gonna Ishishini. I have no idea how to say that. I'm gonna increase. I'm gonna destroy that. And you'll see why I'm gonna destroy the police station. It's, it's the economy, stupid. Port. In. Ready for orders. Disband. It's going to take at least two turns for this guy to get over here, and by then I'll be able to have a. Uh, I'll have an army. The reason I did that is because I can recruit uh, units with better experience for the spear levy and increased accuracy for the levy infantry. So, that said, it makes no sense for me to have them and just suck up some, some uh, koku. What do you wish of me? Instill fever. Fever? I don't know. Our cause is true. Recruitment. To levy. Mission issued. Capture the Fallen Emperor's Mandate, which is increase the spread of uh, Imperial influence. Sir. Yes, my lord. If I'm going to do that, you can get one spear Ready levy. Yeah, I'll do that. Saga trade agreement. And do so with all I'll take it. I'll take some extra. Now, what I'm eventually going to do is I'm going to eventually conquer the entire island. Yeah, there he is. Samurai one. Sir, I already did that. Alright, let's see what happens. In the meantime, I see no reason why I can't recruit. Just a couple more. You know what I just realized? I didn't look at see what I was developing. God dang. Sucker. I get too, uh, I get too gun ho sometimes. And let's see what I can do with this battle. If properly done, I can win. But let's see if I can. Ooh. Ooh. I'm excited.
levy infantry is just like garbage unit, so is the uh, uh, levy spear. But he's got nothing but uh, crap. Actually, no, I take that back. He's got some good units. I think I'm going to lose this town, but that's okay. Actually, no. I got the naval bombardment on my side. Where is he? There he is. Hey, sir, we defend. Let's speed it up. Come on, hurry up. That naval bombardment? Oh, is it deadly? Usually I try to get the generals, but the generals are pretty weak, so I'm going to try to get uh, other units. Come on, come on. Get closer, you son of a bitch. Gonna go, uh... There. Hit, gonna hit him. See that now they're all running away. See if I can get another bombardment down on them. Seconds, come on, I can do it.
Sir, I fear your general is in mortal peril, sir. I won, I'm just gonna end the battle here. I could try to uh, run him down with my general, but kinda pointless, honestly. I could get just a little bit more experience, but what's the deal? Don't really gain nothing. Victory, yeah. Plus, you got that winter attrition. Ooh, yeah. AI makes some really. Ah, damn it. You know what? That's okay. I kind of wanted that anyways, Counselor Court. Modernization, because uh, that leads to the trading port and foreign affairs. That's like, in my opinion, the most important because you get so much money from trade and you can recruit, you can only recruit three, but those three Royal Marines, oh, they can, especially in the early to mid game, they can carry you. Next thing I would want is uh, arms deals. She, she's good. Ministry of training. It, it's all pretty good. Uh, early game, you kind of want all of it, but. Up to your service. Auto resolve. Yeah, they lost everyone. They lost one. one guy. I lost one. Yes, guy. my lord. Ready for orders. There is no higher owner. Up to your command. In you go. Sir. And I don't have uh, enough for that, but that is okay. I'm gonna come around over here. I... Oh, I can trade with my vassal. I can't always... I don't always... Bleh. A friend is always welcome. Request trade agreement. These times of trouble. Come. There we go. It's not much because I don't have many trade res I don't have like any trade resources right now, I don't think. Yeah, I'm importing iron. So Yeah. So it's not really anything of um significance construction import. Oh, okay. Gambling den market. Just kind of got to be patient. As they say, patience is a virtue. One more quote but for uh, patience. Um, Tokugawa Ideyasu. I don't know if he said this for sure, but I know he was a very patient man. But Tokugawa Ideyasu, I saw in a documentary, he said, uh, Do not be so quick to dispose of... Of an enemy that you know you can easily defeat. A one little line infantry. A little bit of spear loving, that's okay. How do you command? Attack! 
soon. You will be mine. Steady as we go. Waiting for new gunners to your positions. In cadet school. This is gonna be my main recruitment hub because of this, the blacksmith. My sword for you, my lord. I will kill all of you. All of you. One thing I really like about the Satsuma clan is it has essentially the same uh, starting position as the Shimazu. And the Shimazu, I don't, I don't know why, but it's like my favorite clan in Vanilla Shogun 2. I think because like it was the first clan I ever played at, not to mention uh, the the katana bonus was just amazing. It was very valuable. Nothing yet. Not much to do in each turn because of um, how little territories I have, you know. In my opinion, it's better to have a, a slow born veteran increase. Cool. Epic architecture. One resolve in military administration, one resolve in supervising recruitment. That's very important. That means it's going to be cheaper for me to recruit things. And when I just got troops stationed there, 5% accuracy all units, which this man is embedded. Okay, that's pretty good. 5% reloading skill, armed troops, and so on. This man is embedded. Accuracy is important, but reload rate is even more. I think I'm going to do... That one. Not yet, I think. Maybe next turn? Yeah, probably next turn. But you know what? I can do a, a den. Yes, my lord. I don't want epic architecture, I want... What do I want? I think I'll go she. Because it enables fire arrows. You see, my plan... Hmm. I'll do she, then I'll do epic architecture. My plan is to have, eventually, have a line of... Oh, cool, I can just auto-resolve that. Is to have a line of, like, regular infantry, like a line infantry, and then behind that... Logistics. This is more passive. I'm gonna go for the long run because I want that. And excuse me, I, I I like this side of the branch better. And uh, no, I didn't burp. I, I suffer from uh, all situations. One percent upkeep cost of all unit ships under this man's control. Each one's like one koku, so get twenty units. That's like twenty koku. Turn. No, that ain't. I'll, I'll take the plus one command. I suffer from uh, diaphragm spa spasms because uh, I don't know. It's a family thing. My dad had it. My brothers have it. Just randomly, it, it it's you know that feeling you get when you hiccup and it just like you suck in. Uh, clan encountered the Oka. Clan destroyed. T acquired. Province capture. That'd be okay. Three and a half. Damn. So, yeah, it's just something my family has. My brothers has it. My dad has it. It's just, it's a diaphragm spasm. If you feel like the same feeling as a hiccup only you just suck in air <laughs> just like that so 
If I do it, I apologize. Nothing I can do about it. Oh, sweet. Is she easy? Great strength. Zeal when assassinating, persuading troops, and rallying the populace. I think it's going to be this. Because I'm going to use him more passively than actively. I think I'll go with that. Growth is important for a port, but I think I'll just take up the straight up cash and then I'll go for the harbor. I mean the port. Uh, not straight up cash, I mean I'll take the, I'll take guaranteed cash over growth because I don't have a trade access to a trading port yet. So that said, I have to wait until I get, um... Oh, I forgot to... This is going to be a money-making province, even though I got barren soil. See, now I can get the port. I think I'll recruit, next turn or so, some Saber Cav. Get two of those in there. Make my army really powerful. Saber Cav is pretty good. Um, it's very good against uh, melee units. But it's... Uh, yeah, it's very good against melee units, and that's when it shines. Not melee units, infantry units. Why do I keep saying infantry and melee? It's very good against infantry units. That's the saber, you know, just kind of like the katana cav was um, in vanilla Shogun 2. But, but, um, the Yari cav is devastating toward, uh, against other, all other cav, and it's quite good. Actually, no. I, th I don't want to recruit that here. Because I'm going to wait a couple times. I'm going to destroy that. I'm going to recruit it here because it's cheaper. Because it's like uh, 1104 there. It's 1200 here. So it's, uh, it's a little bit cheaper. Not by much, but uh, small amounts over a big period of time adds up. That's what you do in real life. Now, okay, don't take uh, financial advice from some random uh, guy straight uh, mounting unrest at Suma. Oh. I did not realize that. Mm, let's do a levy infantry. Yeah, let's do a levy. Um. Yeah, I think I'll do that. Do a levy infantry to keep it there, one more saber cav, and then another line infantry. What do you wish of me? Building the port, and I got nothing right now. I'll do that, build something next turn. This is going to be a money making territory. Always make sure, like, you can do, like, always build according to your needs, but in general, there's really only two types of territory. The territories you want to make money, and the territory you want for recruitment. And by default, I'll do an in. If you're not going to be recruiting things from that territory, turn it into a money maker. Like this, this has nothing here. So I'll put her in here, entertain nobles, she's going to increase, increase the growth. Yeah, so I've got just enough. So one more. And I'll send them over next turn. 
because I plan on declaring war on the Oka. Because I believe they're Shogunate. the calf can go further than my line infantry. No, I'm going to hold this guy here off, actually. Um, how happy is this place? Pretty happy. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to send my son and heir over here, get some experience by uh, this guy. My sword for you, my lord. Get some rank up. Oh, my ship. I forgot about my ship. I'm very, uh, scatterbrained. Yeah, you're not gonna convince my son. She distracted the Up army. At once. Komodo. That's a hostile. Oh, the saga are gone. We just have a trade agreement. So I may go to, uh... Yeah, I may just go there. the same. I think I'll get the armor next. Destination reached. So you guys know, I'm just kind of guessing when it comes to um, how much things are worth, just because of the screen resolution. Just Long story short, in order to record, it's like next to impossible to... Um, my lord. It's next to impossible to, uh, what's it called? Like, have, like, the proper screen, but besides the point, you don't care about that. But I think that this is where I'm going to end the episode. Um. Oh, god damn it. I was researching that the whole time. Whatever. Recruitment time of all ships. Whatever, it's fine. It's fine, I'll just get it. I get way too overzealous. But, yeah, I'm going to do one more turn, then I'm just going to end the episode. And, uh... Ready for orders. All yeah. All hands on deck. We still have a good wind. And, uh... I'll s see you all later. Have a good one. Uh, bye.